ugly base, squash and mudge. Do you know the difference between them and where to use them? Knowing the differences is crucial when working in a team or as a git pro. Let's start with merge, simple and straightforward. It takes other new commits and put them in the target branch through a new commit on the target branch known as merge commit. Here is an example of a main branch with the commits A, B and C and a feature branch taken out of the main branch after commit B. Once this feature branch has some commits like D, E and F, you can try to merge it into the main branch. It will create a new commit as a connecting point between the two branches, which is called merge commit. If you want to see the git graph, you can do so with git log one line graph, which will illustrate the merge. Git rebase, as the name says, rebase the commits. It put the commits ahead of the last commit and keeps a linear history. Take this example, a main branch and a feature branch taken out from the main branch. You are making commits to the feature branch, but then there is a new commit in the main branch. By doing git rebase main within the feature branch, the base of the feature is changed to the last commit of the main. Similarly, if it is the opposite, meaning you do git rebase feature when there are some commits in the feature branch, it will merge them all in the main, making a linear commit history. Git squash is a concept used with git merge. It is two steps, squash and merge, where merge creates a merging commit and preserves the entire commit history. With squash merge, it condenses the commit history of the source branch into a single commit on the target branch. To summarize this all, merge creates a new merge commit that has references to all the individual commits from the source branch. Not to confuse with the fact that deleting the source branch does not delete the commits of the source branch once merged. Squash combines multiple commits from the source branch into a single commit on the target branch. He basically writes the commit history by moving, combining or removing commits from the source branch onto the target branch. That's it for now. If you want to see more such content, make sure to subscribe and I will see you in the next video.